I'm News 6 meteorologist Candace Campos. Thank you for heading on to ClickOrlando.com. It's another day, this time in August, and the storms are going to continue to track in after about 2 o'clock. So as we look here at satellite and radar composite this morning, we are looking mostly dry, but that will be a very different story later on this afternoon. Stopping the clock here at about 7.30 in the morning, could see a few scattered showers across our northwestern zones. We have kind of a frontal boundary that's still sagging to the north, and you can see scattered showers will start to move in from west to east throughout the day. Stopping the clock here at about 2 to 3 o'clock. Plenty of rain, rock and thunderstorms potentially from southern Volusia County into most of Brevard, Orange, Seminole County, down through Osceola County, even clipping parts of Lake and Sumter County. Most of the activity, though, should be pushing offshore as the sun goes down. So for tonight, our official low, it's a humid evening. 76 degrees of the breeze in the southwest at about 5 miles per hour. And as we take you here hour by hour, our highs for today, 93 degrees. Your rain coverage still about 40 to 60 percent off and on throughout the entire day. But it looks like the more Rocking thunderstorms will be after about 2 o'clock, feeling like the triple digits for a few hours. And as we get results for the full seven day forecast, temperatures consistently in the low 90s. Good chance of rain each and every afternoon with overnight lows staying muggy in the mid 70s.